What we're gonna make here is our thickener, or what you may know as a slurry, which is simple. It's one part water to one part equals cornstarch here. You could also use rice flour. Yeah. Rice flour makes for a good thickener, of course, traditional flour. Or you can use potato, potato starch. Potato starch, yeah. Which are all great alternatives for any time that you want to thicken up. You know what I do sometimes at home? Because I eat a lot of oatmeal for breakfast. Mm -hmm. I'll take the extra water from my oatmeal and I'll serve it, or I'll reserve it, and I'll mm -hmm. use that because it's really thick. I'll use that and to thicken other foods. That. We're gonna add that chicken right to this sauce so that it can just caramelize, caramelize. over it. Just get a nice, beautiful glaze. That looks and look lovely. how tender. You know, and, and granted, this chicken was cooked in nine, nine minutes. minutes. Yes. And that's real time. Can you smell that? I smell it from smell over it. here. Yeah. Yeah. You, you oh, really man. smell the aromatics of all of the everything. flavors. Yes, and what I also like to do is just drop a couple of sprigs of basil, basil. in there. I like that. All I need now is to put this lid on. We're going to let those flavors marinate for about a minute or two. 